Welcome back guys to the Let's Play of Scholar of the First Sin. So, we're at the servants' quarters from here. We are going to head on down this ladder. There was an encounter, as I mentioned, uh, some of the past few episodes I did record. The pursuer was down here, and while we were opening up this chest, he ended up evading us. I ended up killing him, but that's how I found out about this area and found out about the Belfry. So we're going to use the lockstone here, and then, yeah, here we go. Also something that I found in Happy Souls was when they were doing the wall in this area. Yeah, here we go. Belfry Luna. So this is it. Friend request ahead. Just screen ahead. We still need to get our other sword, but we got to get some levels first. So hopefully we can get that leveled up and change some gear here soon. Souls too. A long, long, long time ago, the princess she made me, yes, just like so. To guard this bell for the prince's honor. Stay away, foul and dead, or you'll be a goner. <laughs> you do laugh a lot. Stay back! It belongs to the princess, it do. <laughs> you wish to guard the bell? <laughs> he also said that in Happy Souls. For the prince, for the princess, forever. For true. No. <laughs> Useless fool. Filthy undead. Be gone right now and stop with your head. Okay, well, you're kind of, uh, kind of annoying. Uh, I don't know much about this area. <clears throat> I know that it was recommended and my buddy one of my buddies told me that we should do it before we go on to the sinner's rise so that's the plan you know if we get invaded so be it but there's you glencore let's get glencore on in here nice 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 item Skeptic Spice, more of that, not bad. Alright, Glencore, come on. Let's get up on in here. Make some shit finally happen. Glencore is definitely fucking them up. It looks like there's the fog wall. <clears throat> Problem is, though, is that it's got a gate in front of it. So I guess we'll have to head up here. Oh, yeah, more of you guys. Alright, Glencore, we need you up here, buddy. How many of you guys are there? Skeptic Spice, and there's another one of you. How many of you guys are there? Put him in the blender, going core. Down you go. More souls. Another chest, not bad. <clears throat> Radiant Life Gem, Twilight Herb. Nice, two for two. Very, very good. 
looks like right over here is the thing. Go ahead and ring a ding ding ding. You wish to guard the bell, do you? <laughs> Yep, I should open that. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, come on, Glencore. We gotta tackle this. Belfry Gargoyles. Very reminiscent of Dark Souls. Keeps him preoccupied. Okay, well now there's another one. Jesus Christ. Alright, going core. Oh, that's not good. Damage. Almost got him. Oh, Glencore got the final smash. Good job, Glencore. Belfry Gargoyle Soul. Well, now we gotta figure out if that's gonna be worth anything. But we did get a lot of souls. Ugh. So that is a good thing. We got a lot of souls for that. Um, an item over here. Don't want to miss that. Soul of Proud Knight, very useful. I don't know what the Bell Gargoyles give. I will probably use their soul. Um, it's not worth anything. I really gotta get a dual model, man. <sighs> Alright, let's see what's in here. Southern Ritual Ban? Is that what that said? Southern Ritual Ban? It's a knife. What did we just pick up? Fire Seed. Strengthens Pyromancy Flame. Removes additional powers. Reinforces special equipment. Reinforces what normally cannot be reinforced. Huh. Oh, there it is. Allows a two minute of additional spells. That's gonna be useful. So the ritual ban, yeah. And there's a bonfire. Okay, I guess was that the Belfry Luna? Was that it? Surely that couldn't have been it. There I am. Not yet. I'm, I'm gonna get this bonfire real quick. And then what is this? Where do you lead to? A lot of dogs. Like, we're talking a lot of dogs. Holy shit. Um. Let's go ahead and get to casting here a little bit. Can't. Oh, man. You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, they're like all getting ganged up ready, man. I don't even. 
going to fight all those dogs. I'm going to get raped. There's like eight of them down there. This is so stupid. I want that item, though. There we go. Can I not? Got you. What about the other ones? I don't know. We're gonna wing it. being invaded what the fuck what the fuck is this nonsense go oh my god dude my guy's like oh i'm gonna put my finger up my butt and not do anything souls are down there. This is so stupid. Listen to that deep growl. It's like, meh. Oh my god. Yeah, this is retarded. Well, there's my souls all the way down there, and now I gotta do this. So. Ugh, I didn't think I was gonna be fucking invaded minute that I went down. So, my strategy is going to be let's try to get the dogs. Fucking assholes. God damn it. So apprehensive about this, I don't want to lose all those souls, man. We just worked so hard to get that. so good. I get my souls. And we're gonna go over here and sprint. Yeah, that's right, fucktard. Forgel the center. I can just cheese them though. Ah! Uh, didn't think about that, did you? And that's how you play Dark Souls. Human effigy. Dragon Tooth, petrify something, bright love. Dragon Tooth. Surely they don't mean hobble. They do. That's Hobble's tooth. Holy crap, that's crazy. Chanted Falchion. And the Falchion, too. That's absolutely wild. Raw for weapon. Yes, indeed. That is crazy that that's there. Awesome, we found Hobble's tooth, though. So now. Now we can head back and go do the sinners area. Let's go on back to Majula real quick. And we can finally change our weapon. That's pretty cool. So... Let 
was a faith and intelligence on dark attack. Skills will lower these two attributes. Yeah, this sunlight staff, or sunset staff, is really OP, it looks like. So, definitely going to want to be using that. And we need Twinkling Titanite to level that up. <clears throat> but we want to get the Bastard Sword on us as well. Which, that's just regular Titanite, so. We do need to be leveling that up. Can I not infuse? I guess I can only infuse if I was with the other guy, though, so. Master Sword. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. Master Sword. It's getting there, it's pretty strong. Sunset Staff. Let's go ahead and level you on up to the more Twinkling Titan. Right. I'll be around if you make it back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright. So now, take that off. Let's go ahead and put on our Bastard Sword. And if we compare it to the Fire Long Sword now, it's definitely. Definitely has a lot better stats. Um, even though it doesn't have flame on it. So, it's gonna be fun wielding that now. And then for the Sunset Staff, there's our Sorcerer Staff plus 5. And Sunset Staff. Is uh, still a little bit weaker, but we just need to get some more uh, stats on it. So for now, we'll use the Sorcerer Staff. And we are at 70, so how much? We're not fat rolling yet, so that's good. Um, as far as stats go, or not stats, but spells go put on Dark Orb, and then Great Heavy, Heavy, Hush, and a Force. We'll put on Soul Hero for now. We do need to get some more spells soon, and let's go over Dexterity to 20. Alright, so now we can head to the center's area. So, where is that? Salisbury Steel, Center's Rise, Belfry Luna, Center's Rise. So now we can go to this area. I still have the gargoyle uh, soul as well. I don't want to forget that. Ooh. Go ahead and sit me on up here. We're also going to pop uh, one of these. Play more damage, receive less. A bright bud. That's pretty cool. Alright, where are you at? Lucentil, let's get you on in here, and does the big boy respawn? Yes, you do. Holy shit. Not bad, not bad. Now we're just gonna make our way all the way over there. Take you on out. And sprint, sprint, sprint. Get 
dudes are gonna be chasing us. Come on, girl. Let's head over here. And, oh wait, forgot. We have one more summon, I forgot. Should be in one of these rooms. It might be upstairs, actually. I think it is upstairs, yeah. Let's go upstairs real quick. Sword Lewis. We need Cell Sword Lewis. Alright. Now we can head on over here. We're an enemy. Porch required ahead. Oh, we don't have. Oh, wait, maybe we have one of those bright bugs. Yeah, we do. There we go. That's thinking with the old brain. That's cool. Alright, Louie, you gotta get out of the way, buddy. You NPCs are definitely gonna block my way. Should be another sconce over here. I'm doing this because I'm OCD. I'm sorry. I have to do it. If I don't, it'll bother me. All right. Yeah. Let's uh. Let's see how this goes. Good luck. All right. So let's go ahead and get on in here. Big boss. She's kind of tanking on uh, Lilith, but the bad thing is, is that she moves pretty fast. I'm guessing this boss is she. dark in here. We're all for victory. She gave us a lot of souls. Damn. Let's see what's in here. Wretch ahead and then liar ahead. Okay.
offering a branch of your Elizabeth Mushroom. Another of your branch, which is very good. Fake wall, no. Bonfire. Which is in a big empty open room. Primal bonfire lit. The primal bonfire was rekindled. I have no idea what that means. Uh, what did I say? Where are we going? Oh, God. I don't want to go anywhere where I don't need to be yet. That's not good. Oh, we're back in Majula. Okay. Cool. So, I will be back real quick. I'm going to go see what these souls do for the gargoyles and the lost center. And if they don't do anything or have anything I want, I'm going to eat them. But before I do that... <clears throat> this and pop this so soul of the lost center don't forget gargoyle okay yeah all right i'm back guys so yeah we get basically the gargoyle weapon for theirs and the uh, lost center sword for this so i'm not gonna be using either of those so we're gonna eat them just gonna eat the soul Titanite shards, and then we need Twinkling Titanite, so we gotta start looking for that stuff. And as far as shields go, it's still looking like uh, ours is one of the best. I might look up if the Watch Dragon Karma is one of the better shields in the game. I really can't believe I couldn't believe it is, if it is, um, because it's given us so early at the Hyatt's place, but we will just have to see. Um, I'll, I will probably look that up on my own time, though. Uh, but other than that, we can't really level anything up. I'm not gonna level up any armor Look, yet. Don't waste my time. So we'll just go and level up and normally. And you have acquired call. the soul of an old one. That is more than most undead can say. Oh, alright, we uh, got some more dialogue. That's pretty cool. So let's see, Dex. Woo! Yeah, we got a lot of souls. So let's go ahead and get our decks to 20, and then strength and decks are where they're going to be. They're maxed out. Um, agility, we need to get our adaptability up. Uh, one of my buddies has been telling me to put stats up in that for sure. And faith and intelligence, we do need to be putting stuff in there. So I think for right now we're going to stick with... Where should I put it? It doesn't matter though, because everything's gonna go up, but thinking Yeah, you have to build it next. Might be best. Alright. So from here? Um I'm trying to think, where could we go next? Okay, well I haven't got it, so we have the fragrant branch of yore. We need to use one of those on the area up that way, kind of behind this menu where that guy was sitting and that statue blocks the way. There's that, and then also we can start heading to the Huntsman's Coast. So, next episode, we'll probably do one of those two things. So, yeah. Uh, I guess we'll figure that out once we get to it. So, I will see y'all in the next episode.